dear children today we will do question number 6 to question number 10 of exercise 5.7 of unit division so let's start with question number 6 nine persons plant 828 trees in a day if each person plants the same number of trees find the number of trees planted by him so tree, uh, number of trees nine persons plant is equals to 828 so each person plants same number of trees every person has planted or every person plants same number of trees equal number of trees so we have to find the number of trees planted by him means planted by each person so let us write the statement first of all because in this we need to divide so trees nine persons plant in a day is equals to 828 now then we will write each person plants the same number of trees same number of trees therefore the number of trees planted by him means by each person will be 828 divided by 9 now let us divide 828 by 9 now our divisor is of single digit so we need to look for the single digit from the dividend but it is less than the divisor so we need to take 2 so 9 9s are 81 is nearest to 82 so let us subtract here we have 1 and here 0 now this 8 will come here so now 9 2s are 18 the remainder will be 0 therefore we can say that therefore each person planted 92 trees okay if nine persons plants 828 trees in a day so each person planted 92 trees now the next question is question number 7 a poultry farm sold 1757 eggs in a week in a week means in 7 days a poultry farm sold 1757 eggs so how many eggs were sold each day each day means every day for that we need to divide so let us write first of all we'll write eggs sold in a week means in bracket we will write 7 days that is 1757 then we will find therefore eggs sold each day is equals to 1757 now we cannot divide by the word week so we need to divide by number of days in a week so we will divide it by 7 now let us divide 1757 by 7 so the first digit of the div uh, dividend is less than the divisor so we will take the two digits so we'll say uh, 7 twos are 14 because 7 threes are 21 is greater so when we will subtract we'll get 3 here now this 5 will come here so 7 fives are 35 when we will subtract we'll get 0 then 7 will come here now 7 ones are 7 the remainder is 0 therefore we can say 251 eggs were sold each day means every day the poultry farm sold 251 eggs 
Now the next question is question number eight. A man sold one four one zero liters of milk in ten days. How many liters of milk did he sell in a day? So in ten days, a man sold this much liters of milk. So how many liters of milk did he sell in a day? That we need to find. So for finding the information about one day, if more than one day's information is given to us, so we need to divide. So let us write the statement. we will write milk sold in 10 days that is 1410 liters okay therefore milk sold in a day is equals to 1410 divided by Ten. So we need to divide. Let us divide one four one zero divided by ten. So ten ones are ten because ten twos are twenty will be greater. So after subtracting, we will get four as the remainder. Now this one will come here. So ten fours are forty. When we will subtract, we will get one. Now this zero will come here. So ten ones are ten. The remainder is zero. Therefore, one four one liters. of milk was sold in a day means every day 141 liters of milk was sold so oh, the next question is 4000 boxes of apples are to be loaded equally in seven trucks there are 4000 boxes of apples and uh, they need to be loaded in seven trucks but equally okay equal number of boxes will be loaded in each truck so find the number of boxes loaded in each truck that we need to find and the number of boxes left out that we also have to find out so for finding the number of boxes loaded in each truck we need to divide because the keyword here is each fine so first of all we will divide then we will ultimately come to know that what is the number of boxes left out so let us write the statement solution 9 we will write boxes of apples to be loaded equally in seven trucks is equal to 4000 okay is equal to 4000 therefore boxes loaded in loaded in each truck for that we need to divide 4000 by 7 so let us divide 4000 by 7 so we'll take two digits from the dividend because of the one digit if we will take it will be less than the divisor so 75s are 35 and 76 are 42 42 will be greater so we'll take 75s are 35 when we will subtract we will get 5 as the remainder now this zero will come here now 77s are 49 again 50 minus 49 1 is the answer now this zero will come here now 7 1s are 7 so 10 minus 7 3 is the answer okay or if you don't know how to subtract this you can subtract 40 and 35 like this here separately you can borrow and you can do the same steps as you simply do in the subtraction sum okay you can simply subtract it subtract it somewhere else and then you can write the answer here okay so boxes loaded in each truck is 571 and whatever is the remainder it will be the number of boxes left out so let us write therefore 571 boxes what to write find the number of boxes loaded in okay 571 boxes were or will be loaded loaded in each truck and 
थ्री बॉक्सेस वर लेफ्ट आउट ओके सो आफ्टर डिवीजन वी कैन इजिली फाइंड दैट हाउ मेनी बॉक्सेस वर लोडेड इन ईच ट्रक एंड हाउ मेनी बॉक्सेस लेफ्ट आउट ओके नाउ द लास्ट क्वेश्चन इज क्वेश्चन नंबर टेन राइट अ स्टोरी फॉर ईच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग नाउ टू डिवीजन नंबर सेंटेंसेज आर गिवन एंड वी नीड टू राइट अ स्टोरी फॉर दैम और यू कैन से अ स्टेटमेंट सम फॉर दीज टू गिवन नंबर सेंटेंसेज सो वॉट वी कैन राइट लेट अस राइट द सिंपलेस्ट वन दैट प्राइस ऑफ फाइव बैग्स इज रुपीज वन थर्टी फाइव सो फाइंड द प्राइस ऑफ वन बैग ओके वॉट एवर इन्फॉर्मेशन इन दिस डिविजन सम इज गिवन इट इज ऑफ फाइव थिंग्स ओके सो एंड वी नीड टू फाइंड द इन्फॉर्मेशन अबाउट वन थिंग ओके सो वी कैन से द प्राइस ऑफ फाइव बैग्स इज रुपीज वन हंड्रेड थर्टी फाइव this is the first information that price of five bags is 135 now if it is a division sum we need to say find the price of one bag okay this is how we can frame a story sum for the given division number sentence now let us do the second one second one simply you can frame in the same manner okay or you can say um a man earns rupees 4708 in 4 days in 4 days a man earns this much so how much does he earn in a day a man's earning of 4 days is given and we need to find his earnings of a single day so uh, framing a statement sum story sum is up to you that how you think upon a given situation so it is up to you how you frame a story sum you can frame the simplest one also or you can try something else also as per your creativity your thinking fine so i hope you would have understood all the questions that we have 